So today I'm talking about a P0139 code, what it is and how you go about fixing it. And so what is a P0139 code? Well, it's an O2 sensor circuit slow response bank one sensor two. And what does this mean? Well, there's sensors and they're located on the exhaust and they do two things. The first thing they do is they monitor the catalytic converter. And then the second thing they do is they monitor how much oxygen was burnt off during combustion. And they report this information to the computer, which uses it to adjust the air fuel ratio mixture that's going into the cylinders. And for some reason, the computer's seeing a problem with this. And so it's got to be troubleshooted in OI. And if you have a V6 or V8 engine, you're going to have two banks. The bank one is always on the side of the engine with the number one cylinder. And then the opposite of that would be bank two. So if you find the number one cylinder on your engine, that's going to be the side of the engine that's having the issues. If you have a four cylinder engine, it wouldn't matter because you only have one bank. And it can be a good idea to get a diagram where all the sensors are located on your particular vehicle. It just makes things easier to know where everything's at. For example, this is a 2007 Camry with a 3.5 liter V6. And as you can see, bank one sensor two is going to be right here. And it's going to be located after the catalytic converter or right on it. And it's going to be called the downstream oxygen sensor. Sensor one is going to be located before the catalytic converter. And it's also called the upstream oxygen sensor. But the one having the issue is going to be this bank one sensor two oxygen sensor. Once you locate that sensor, there's some different ways to go about testing it. I made some videos on that. I'll put a link down below if you need to check that out. But the first thing to do is to test that sensor and see if it has failed. Also keep in mind that if there's anything wrong inside the wiring, open, short, bad connection, anything like this. So if any of these wires are having an issue going to the sensor, then that's going to cause the same symptoms as a bad sensor. So you can't test this wiring if you want to. Be sure that there's no open, shorts, anything like that. Sometimes these can be on fuses and even relays. For example, here's a 2004 Toyota Tacoma. And right here you have the AF heater. And over here you have a relay named AF heater. And that's for that sensor or the air fuel ratio sensor. There's also a heater element built in those sensors that monitor the catalytic converter. But basically keep in mind that sometimes they could be on fuses. But the next thing that could cause this is some kind of issue with the wiring. Another thing that could cause this sometimes is if there's an exhaust leak. Because if outside air gets into the exhaust, it could throw these sensors off and cause them to get bad readings and things like this. So you can't check out the exhaust and be sure that it looks and look like it's damaged or leaking or anything like that. Because the last thing on the list is going to be an exhaust leak. And so that's basically it. I just wanted to give a basic overview of how you go about fixing a vehicle with the P0139 code. If you have anything to add, please comment down below. If you have any questions, ask me and I'll try to answer them. If this video helps you, please click like, please click subscribe, and have a good day.